Hey, Rory Goddard here. Thanks for tuning in. In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you my personal experience using Sprizzy. So I'm going to give you a Sprizzy review uh, based on uh, two experiences that I've had using Sprizzy. So last December, I tried Sprizzy for the very first time. I created a review about that back then. <clears throat> I think it was in maybe January. I, I ended up making that review. You can check that out here. In that review, I go into a little bit more detail into the back off at, at end of Sprizzy and show you how to actually set up your campaign and what all of that looks like so if you want to check that out do head back but I tried using Sprizzy again in April so I want to share my experience of that and you know combine the two experience to give you a really good in-depth review of Sprizzy so you can decide whether it's worth do it, you know, trying Sp Sprizzy and using their services. Um, so I hope this really helps you out in that regard. So what I want to do is I want to start with the engagement report within Sprizzy. So once a campaign has actually finished, you can actually go in through here and, and look at a, an engagement report. Now, when I started uh, this campaign, I actually started with this video here. Um, but it was performing very badly. So I decided to stop that campaign and I switched it over to this video here. So we'll just be looking at this one. So I, I put in $25 for the campaign, which was supposed to be around um, 733 views or something like that. Um, so over the over the two videos, it, it reached uh, roughly that target. Um, so this was a video. If we go to the cog here and click that button I just clicked, uh, that will bring you through to the engagement report within within Sprizzy. So I want to show you that, and then I want to take you across to YouTube and show the, you all of the analytics in YouTube for this video to see how it performed. Now, so this is one of the great things about Sprizzy is that it does provide you with this engagement report. But obviously, uh, once you go over, once I show you inside YouTube, you you will get a better feel for. Um, exactly what happened while this this uh, campaign was going. So as you can see here, it started on the 16th of April and went through to the, the 20th of April. These are all the views that I got um, and the total, total views down here while the campaign was running. Uh, it will also show you, um, so you can see discovery views, so the different types of ads. So the way that Sprizzy works is they actually run Facebook, uh, YouTube ads for you. Um, so you can guarantee that they're not bots. The views that you're getting are real people, uh, but they're just discovering these videos via uh, YouTube ads that, that uh, Sprizzy run for you. Um, you can see the subscribers and also the likes and dislikes. So in regards to the subscribers, it's this, what I'll show you when we get into the analytics, uh, I'm pretty sure these subscribers didn't actually come from this particular video. It came from other videos, but Sprizzy only recorded, um, you know, the total subscribers during this period and put them in there. No, it's not necessarily saying that this video actually created those subscribers. Um, so, you know, it doesn't give you too much detail really about how well well the video performed. As you can see, I got a like and a dislike during um, the time that this video was, um, was running, the campaign was running. Um, but let's now go over to, to YouTube where we're going to get a much more in-depth review of how this video actually performed during the campaign. Okay, so here we are in the analytics for the video. Now, the first thing that I want to show you because it's probably your biggest concern is I want to show you where the views actually came from for this video. So you're probably thinking, you know, uh, is Sprizzy selling me fake views? Are they using bots? You know, when I promote my video through Sprizzy, Am I, are they going to be real people actually watching these videos? Um, so I want to go to audience here and then we can go down to see more traffic sources and you can see that YouTube advertising 520 views. So you can see that it's genuine. Sprizzy promote their, the, the videos that you put into campaigns through genuine YouTube advertising. The next piece of analytics that I want to share with you is the subscribers. So this, according to YouTube, I gained three subscribers through this video. Uh, now, whether or not those three subscribers came through people finding this video through the, the ads that Sprizzy ran or whether those three subscribers came through the 16 or so views that came organically, you just don't know. I mean, in general, most people are going to be more receptive to a video when they come across it organically than what they do through an ad. And really, that's probably the biggest downside for Sprizzy is that, yes, they're, they're going to be YouTube ads, which 
you know, people may not be as receptive to. It's going to really depend on what niche you're in and what your video is all about, how engaging it is. Another important piece of the analytics and one that's really important for your channel is the audience retention. So how long are people actually staying on your video for? So for this video, you can see that the average view duration is 2 minutes and 27 seconds for a 6 minute and 84, uh, 48 second video. So the, you can see the audience retention for this one wasn't too bad. You can see that by the end of the video, there were still 17.6% of people watching this video. Now, another argument you could have here is that, you know, the 16 organic views that this video got, perhaps most of the, the average was bumped up by those people because they're going to be more receptive to this video as opposed to coming across it through an ad. But you can see that, you know, this at least confirms that it's it is real people watching these videos now if you compare these statistics to the video that i ran a campaign for back in december you can see the audience retention was a lot lower you know 44 seconds and you can see this very sharp drop off and by the end only uh, 1.3% 1, 1 of people were still watching it. Now, you can look at these two videos and say, you know, this one's a lot longer than this one. So potentially that could be a reason why people just aren't willing to stick around. They can see that it's such a longer video. You can, um, at this time, you know, this is what, four or five months ago that I created this video. Uh, so potentially my performance on camera, my engagement and everything like that probably wasn't as good as what it was when I created this video. And so what this basically gives you the indication is your the way that your video performs through Sprizzy is really going to depend on the quality of the video. So, and, and then when you think about that, you know, the quality of, of the video, um, if you're producing good content, it's probably going to grow naturally, organically anyway. All right guys, so is Sprizzy a scam? No, Sprizzy is not a scam. They genuinely do use YouTube advertising, but that doesn't necessarily mean that you should use uh, Sprizzy to grow your YouTube channel. As you can see, you know, I've gained um, three subscribers here and I think I gained one subscriber from this video. Uh, one way, ironically, that um, Sprizzy has helped me grow even more so is I gained six subscribers through the rev the first review I did of, did of Sprizzy. So that's quite ironic. But in terms of the actual campaigns that I run, they didn't really help to grow my channel. And since then, I haven't really uh, you know gotten more views on other videos or anything like that. Um, so for me personally, it hasn't really helped, and I'm definitely. I won't be using Sprizzy again. I'm just going to rely on making my videos better and continuing to produce content and, and you know, and, and grow organically. However, you know, you can see that it does have potential. It's running proper YouTube ads. Um, so, you know, if you're not skilled in setting those all up, that up if you've got if you're good on camera and you can cr create really engaging videos and you're in a niche that is probably more entertaining or something like that then potentially Sprizzy has the potential there to actually help you grow your channel it is you're getting it out in front of real targeted viewers through Sprizzy um, so you know it's really going to be up to to you to determine whether it's going to be worth doing it. So if you look at this video here, you would see that you'd probably be thinking, oh yeah, no, um, I don't think it's worth it. But then if you come across and see, see this video where the audience retention wasn't too bad and, you know, performed pretty well, got three subscribers, you know, is $25 worth three subscribers? Um, but, you know, potentially, you, like I said, you would you might get more depending on what niche you're in, how engaging you are, how good you actually create that video. Um, so, my final thought is that it's really going to be up to you and, and your niche and, and how good you, your video is as to how well it's going to perform on Sprizzy. Sprizzy definitely isn't a scam. They use real YouTube ads. Um, but other than that, guys, I, you know, I, I really will not be using Sprizzy again personally for my YouTube channel. All right, guys, so I hope I've been able to help you to make an informed decision as to whether or not it's worth you investing in Sprizzy to help you grow your channel. If I have helped you in any way whatsoever, make sure you smash that like button and let me know, uh, you know, show me your appreciation. And if you want to learn how to monetize your YouTube channel without creating any of your own products, or anything like that, go down to the description, click the first link and sign up to the 100% free training where you will learn how to do that. 
Other than that, guys, I really hope you enjoyed the video. And remember, dream big, live from the heart, and do whatever it takes. See you again soon.